Some researchers concluded that Maka is located at the center of the Earth, among whom is Dr. Farouk Abdul Badi. After carrying out many consecutive researches that lasted for more than 10 years, Al Aram Egyptian newspaper mentioned in its issue No. 41445 that this conclusion was based on historic and geographical reference books and on the results of the atomic watch. The researcher recommended that Maka should be taken as the basis for calculating the time instead of Greenwich because Greenwich was chosen on the basis of political agreement and not on the basis of scientific and astronomical phenomena. Also, among these researchers was Dr. Hussain Kamal ad-Din. As he wrote in the Islamic Research Magazine which is published by the Presidency of Iftah and Scientific Research Department in Saudi Arabia, in its issue No. 2, a long research, in which he proved with evidence, studies, statistics and researches that Makkah is the center of the earth. Sheikh Salman ibn Fahd al-Oda, while commenting on this, said, It is for this reason that the earliest jurists of the Shafi'i and Hanafi school among others mentioned that there is a day in the year in which there is no shade for things, at midday, in Makkah, there is one day in the year in which all the things at midday have no shade. Why is that? It is because the sun is totally perpendicular on Makkah, so there is no shade for things. This matter does not contradict what is mentioned about the equator being the center of the earth. This is because those who said that Makkah is the center of the earth, have explained that they meant the land with the exclusion of its surface which is covered with water. Indeed, Dr. Hussain said in his research which we referred to above, we noticed when we drew a circle whose center is the city of Maka, and its boundaries outside the seven continents, that the circumference of this circle goes around the limits of the outside continents. This means that the location of the city of Maka is the center of the Earth's land surface. As regards the equator, it divides the whole surface of the Earth including water and land.